are some self mobilization techniques uh, that you can use to um, to help um, with the first rib mobility. Um, so you want to take something like a strap or belt, something that's firm. You don't want to use anything that's stretchy or has much give to it. And you're gonna kind of drape it over, and you can either hold uh, both ends in one hand here right by your side or you can have one hand behind your back and one hand in front and you're gonna hold um, you're gonna hold some pressure downward there so kind of downward and on an angle so you want to stay nice and firm there and you're gonna tilt your head down and towards that uh, towards that armpit on the painful side so this is the painful side um, and you want to make sure that you get right over that first rib hold the pressure and just uh, bring your chin towards that armpit. And you can hold there, you wanna hold there for um, you know, at least uh, 20 seconds or so, and then you can relax, and you wanna do that, you wanna repeat that a few times. And just holding the pressure with that head down, the head moving down in, um, towards that side, that's gonna put your scalenes, which are some of these muscles on the side of your neck, that's gonna put, um, put them in a relaxed position because those are the guys that are wanting to pull upwards on that first rib. So again, just holding and relaxing. So that's one technique. Another thing you can do is if you have um, like a lacrosse ball or tennis ball, um, anything that's a little bit firm, you can kind of put it in that same spot, kind of right where that first rib kind of wraps right around your neck. You put it in there and then you're going to do that same position so your chin is going down towards your armpit on that side and just holding that there about 10 to 20 seconds and then releasing and you can do that you know a few times uh, just spent a few minutes um, working on getting that guy uh, to come down All right